you might rain today. You haven't been right about the weather since 1972. Einer and Mitch lived life by their own rules. Nice wheels, Einer. I like the flag. Without an orange flag like that, you might look ridiculous. But they never expected their time would be interrupted by someone on the run from the past. I don't want you here. I don't want to be here either. It's yours? She's yours too. Telling me I have a grandchild? Einer, please. Just so I can earn enough to get us out of here. Are those my dad's things? Yeah, they are. Where does he live now? He's dead. Didn't your mother tell you that? Yeah, but she said you're dead too. Now, two men unaccustomed to change. I wonder if it's hard being that drunk this early in the morning. Oh, now look what you went and what? did. I'm gonna be your new waiter. Oh. Oh. Sorry for the mess. We'll have to learn to adjust. I got some groceries for dinner. You got any more improvements you want to make around here? But maybe Mitch might want to work on something. Did you ask him about it? Of course she did. I feel inspired. And discover the only thing harder than holding on. They call them accidents because it's nobody's fault. My son's dead. Your granddaughter's not. And neither were you. Is letting go. I want to know what killed my boy. I killed a minor. Is that what you want to hear? Did you hear anything unusual last night? Somebody poking around down by the river. It's a police report. He was my boyfriend. They can't do anything, Einer, except keep an eye on him. There's an errand in town I'd like to run. Be careful with that errand. You know anything about pickup trucks? OK, you see these screws here? Mm -hmm. They're dead, they You getting the hang of it? I see you back here again, I'll kill you. You've seen too many westerns, old man. That doesn't exactly work in your favor. You ever wish you had lived a different life? No. There are people everywhere who think they got dealt a bad hand. <laughs> An unfinished life. I had a music teacher who was a lesbian. You guys are gay, right? <laughs> I always thought you had really lovely hands. You never told me that. <laughs>